Hello, I'm Chris. Today we're going to talk to you about hinges, how to install the hinges on the doors, different types of overlay for these hinges, and then how to get the doors mounted onto the cabinets. These are European style soft closed hidden hinges. They come in sizes 3 8 to 1 and 9 16 depending on the overlay of the door you have in your kitchen. And they mount very simply. The door you order is going to have the cup hole board already in it. You just need to place the hinge in the hole, press it down so it's flat, make sure it is square shoulder to the edge of your door, like that so it's even, and then drive two screws into the open holes. Very simple. So if you choose to have your doors bored by us, they will come three inch centers down from the top and up from the bottom is a standard bore. Today we're going to use the half inch overlay hinge, which is the most common hinge in kitchens. So what you do is place it inside the pre-drilled hole. Make sure it's down snug all the way. Square up the shoulders to make sure it is even with the edge of the door. And install two screws into the holes. So we'll mount the second screw. That's all there is to it. Very simple operation to get the hinges mounted. So we'll move to the upper hinge. Make sure it is square with the shoulder. And install the two screws. There you have it. Now you're ready to install this door onto the cabinets. So now that you've installed your hinges, and again we've used half inch overlay hinges on this particular setup, they're the most common in kitchens today, we're going to mount this door to the cabinets. Now the, the hinges we're using today are for mounting to face frame cabinetry, so they will actually mount right to the side of the frame of the cabinet. Now you're ready to hang the door on your cabinet, so you want to put it to the height of the overlay you're looking for in your kitchen, across the bottom here. Get your hinge centered on the face frame and drive the screw. One on the bottom, and one on the top. Now that you've hung your door onto your cabinetry, you're going to need to adjust it to allow for things being out of square and out of level. Notice how this door is wobbling at the top. So there's two ways to adjust these hinges. The back screw will adjust the hinges in and out off the face frame to stop that wobble. So now you can see it's tight. The other screw in the front is to adjust the door going left and right. So you want to look at your reveal. You see you have a larger reveal at the top than you do here at the bottom. At the top we have three quarters of an inch. At the bottom we're showing five eighths of an inch. So I can run that front screw out to bring that door over. Until it's where you need it to be. Give it a little more. There we go. So now your door is tight on the top and the bottom, even across the bottom. Your reveal is even and it's in line with the other doors beside it. 